Hi everybody, it's Carol at Big Cat Rescue and maybe we should start something called Fan Mail Friday because you guys send an awful lot of really sweet letters and I apologize for any letters that are missed. The only time I can do something like this is when I can grab a few minutes and this just happened to be what was sitting on my desk. One of the things that frequently happens is somebody will send us a beautiful card and really sweet words and they'll address it to Carol and Jamie or Carol and Jamie and Gail or Carol and Jamie and Gail and Afton or <laughs> they'll name all these different people so once I read it I pass it on down the line and I haven't been saving them so um, these are just the ones that are still on my desk and I wanted to read out some of them I hope it's okay I, I haven't gone to each person and said hey is it okay if I share your message so I'm only going to refer to people by their first names so that I don't embarrass anybody um, this was one that I actually had passed on and I was able to track down <laughs> and I love it because it came with these cute little cats they precious I love them and it says I'm wild about you on the back and they're clearly handmade with the little eyes Jamie saw these and she said, man, we could sell those in the gift shop. I, I, I think that would probably take somebody a long time to do that. And those came from Kristen. And it says, Carol, Jamie, Keepers, and Cats. So this one's got to be passed around quite a bit. In close, please find a donation to Tampa Give Day. Thank you. And thank you for your work. Tireless advocacy on behalf of the cats. I watch Carol's live videos so much as much as I can, bringing joy to my evening commute. I hope you're like on a bus, <laughs> not driving and watching those. And I will be seeing the sanctuary and visiting in a virtual in a virtual way with the cats. I apologize. I was crying earlier because some of these were so touching as I was reading through them and I wear contact lenses. The world is an interesting and confusing place right now, but watching the dedicated care the keepers provide these cats from feeding those picky boys multiple times a day and giving Zeus and Seth, Seth comforting mists from the hose, it makes me happy that there is still goodness out there. Thank you for all you do, Kristen. Thank you, Kristen. We will continue to share that. I think this is the one that got me crying earlier, so let's just work our way through this one, huh? <laughs> uh, this one came from Marlene, and she said, On Monday, May 1st, my sister Robin and I were visiting from blank, blank, for the first time, and uh, on our fourth tour in a three-day period. Our private tour guide was Susan Bass. Meeting you was amazing, and your kindness concerning Mickey, their favorite cat, meant the world to me. I've dreamt of visiting Big Cat Rescue since I discovered you in 2006 and adopted Aurora Tiger because she was cross-eyed and drooled just like my baby Shauna. In 2015, I lost Shauna at 17 to kidney failure, and I made this photo of her with Joseph a few months before she died. That was the photo she did. I'm so happy I was able to show it to you in person and I wanted you to have a copy. I lost Shauna's sister Cassidy at 15 two years earlier from lymphoma. I was not blessed with children and Cassidy and Shauna were that for me. Their deaths were devastating and I grieve for them still. Last year I got new baby kittens from a local rescue. I named one of them Kimba in honor of your Kimba and named her sister Kateri. I fell in love with Kimba Tiger during the 17 days that she had with you, the best weeks of her life. Her memory lives on in my Kimba, and I thought it would be happy for you to, I thought you would be happy to know that. And I am. Thank you. I admire you, Carol, and everyone who surrounds you. You are a remarkable woman, and the retirement home that you've created for abused and neglected cats is exemplary. The love and medical care you provide these cats is phenomenal. I followed you for so many years on Facebook, and meeting you on Monday was the cherry on the top of my list, but certainly not my last visit. I just read your thank you for the Give Day Tampa Bay results. I donated twice yesterday, and I'm so pleased Big Cat Rescue received double your goal. 
Well done and yay for the big cats. With love and great appreciation, Marlene. And she also sent another picture. And this says Kimba. So this is the one that she named for Kimba Tiger. Can I put the cups back together or should I keep them apart from paper tour? Oh, sorry. <laughs> and she also Happy. sent this card. It says, Dear Carol, this comes especially for you with warmest thanks to say the memory of your thoughtfulness will last for many a day. You and Big Cat Rescue are amazing. Thank you for everything you do for the cats. Love, Marlene. We love you too, Marlene. Oh, sorry. I thought I got this out of my system before I started hitting record here. So here's a happier one. <laughs> this came from Patricia and her cats Pandora, Peach, and Chip. And they sent honeysuckle spray. I love the smell of honeysuckle. It says, Dear Big Cat, Big Cat Rescue, I am sending the big cats some summer fun. While looking at one of your older videos where you talk about how the cats like different smells such as cologne, perfume, and of course catnip. Honeysuckle spray is a very pleasant smell for cats and also had catnip qualities. My three rescue cats love honeysuckle spray and I was wondering if you ever tried honeysuckle spray on any of the cats in your care. I don't think we have. My husband and I spray honeysuckle on old toys and beds and then it suddenly becomes like new to my cats. I have provided a small bottle of honeysuckle spray and all the information from Kitty, Co Kitty Cottage, that's spelled with a K, Kitty, and well, of course, and Cottage is spelled with a K, that makes the honeysuckle spray in my local area, which is in Canada. And then she sends all the information on it, which is good because our vets will want to approve anything that the cats get, and so that way they know exactly what's in the spray. And it's a new sealed bottle, which is also important to us to make sure that we don't give the cats anything that might come from one of the bad guys pretending to be a good guy who would want to hurt our cats. This beautiful card, everybody knows how much I love the beach, is from Kathy. Kathy with a K. And it says, Dear Carol, dropping a quick line to wish you a happy Mother's Day. You're a good mom in many ways, even for the big cats. All those live feeds make me feel like family and part of BCR. Everyone there, from what I can see, is dedicated to excellence, they are, that comes out in all of the videos and the way the cats are treated. Can't say enough. Can I please get a golf cart to the uh, vacation rotation? Sounds like somebody ran out of steam at the vacation rotation enclosure. <laughs> Can't say enough about your sanctuary. I am trying to save money so I can make a trip to greet you, Jamie, and your volunteers, especially Gail. Obviously see some, and obviously see some of my favorite cats. I love them all! Exclamation mark! Exclamation mark! <laughs> I would love to come by Saber's next birthday, March 1st. He will be 26. Two hearts. Saber. Saber is on the tour path, I hope. Carol, I just love all you do. You touch my life in a really big way. I, ha I have to save for more t-shirts. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> and hope you have a great Mother's Day. Love your Sacramento fan, Kathy. And then P.S. My cats love to hear your voice. Honey, are you on the radio? They are really chatty on the radio today. My cats love to hear your voice when the live feeds on, they fall asleep. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah, I'm just putting people and cats to sleep all across America. You don't need those Ambien or nighttime medications. Just listen to me and you'll be fine. This was a cute one I got from Rooney. And it sounds like Rooney was writing for himself and his mom. And it says, hi, Carol, Rooney here. We need a golf cart to the vacation rotation. Rooney here to say, I enjoy watching my big cousins with my mom. Makes me wonder if maybe Rooney's a cat. I'm glad they have you and all of the great. Is anyone taking a golf cart? I'm glad they have you and all of the great staff taking care of them. 
Mom loves her cat sunglasses. They're like these. <laughs> I love those sunglasses. You can get those over at catrescue.biz. Okay. It says, Mom loves her sunglasses. I think she looks perfect in them. Of course, she made perfect. She just ordered the shirt with pure with <laughs> she wrote it Pira's and now I'm saying Pira's with Priya's paw print on it. Dave, can you come to the cup when you're available? She just ordered the shirt with Priya's paw print on it and one of her favorite cats is Mickey. She has a nerve problem which affects her back and night leg as she has some problem walking and says Mickey is her inspiration. Just like Mickey, she is now walking without a cane. Tell Mickey he really has helped her. Thanks from Rooney. My mom has a big heart and she does her best to help BCR and she is spreading and sharing to make more humans aware of the need to stop the pay to play. Hope you enjoyed hearing from me. Say hi to all my big cousins for me. Love Rooney and mom. And I don't know what mom's name is because the letter came from Rooney. This one is from Gabriella Mixon. Oop, I said the last name. Sorry about that. Um, hope she doesn't mind. It's not really personal as far as like being anything that I shouldn't share. It said, God, whose name is Jehovah, tells us in Proverbs 12:10. The righteous one takes care of his animals. Thank you for all you do working and caring for Jehovah's wildlife animals. Thank you. It came with a cute little rhino on it. This one came with a gift and it's from Barbara. And I was a little confused because the first letter that I wrote read in here was somebody else writing a thank you note to Barbara. But later when I read Barbara's email I, or letter, I understood what that was about. So Barbara wrote, Dear Carol and Jamie, the two of you do so very much for all the cats that I wanted to do something for you. I purchased two handcrafted tiger totem necklaces on, on Rusty Lane or maybe Ruby Lane. Well, I should be able to tell from this. Um, Ruby Lane. I have included the Xerox descriptions plus the thank you card from Connie. I'm not sure how she blessed these necklaces, but good thoughts going your way can only help. Hopefully, my husband and I will visit BCR this coming November. Catherine is giving us a private tour on November 9th. I think it's a Thursday, so we'll be the only ones there. I am so excited. After sponsoring some of the cats and watching, a face, and watching on Facebook, plus all of Dr. Justin's operations, he's amazing, three exclamation marks, I feel I know all of you. Maybe I'll even get to meet you both. Signed Barbara. P.S. Um, and she tells me how to handle the jewelry so that I don't mess it up. So you don't need to hear the P.S. So the thank you note that Connie sent her when she bought these items that I'm about to show you says, Dear Barbara, your beautiful tiger totem necklaces have been blessed with the with the divine and loving energy with which they were designed and created. They were also infused with universal energy and the light of the solar rays to be used for your highest and best good. And then she talks about the, the packaging that they're kept in so that they don't tarnish. So that was nice. And then they came in these beautiful boxes. Can you see that? So pretty. So apparently Barbara bought these from Connie and then she sent them to Jamie and I. And Jamie hasn't seen these yet, so I'm blowing the surprise by posting this. So it's beautiful tiger's eye with a tiger. And I don't know if you can see, but the tiger's kind of got like a little cutout. So 
so apparently you can buy those on ruby lane and then these little bags are supposed to be good for like three years to keep them from tarnishing which is cool because you know how silver does sometimes but that's nice it's very luxurious I, you can't get a sense of what those feel like but it's a really substantial necklace very heavy stones beautiful tiger eye stones and then this one is a medallion of a leopard and again it's really a heavy heavy necklace these crystals are just gorgeous with the little diamond accents there and then can you see that it's just beautiful like amber eyes well, thank you so much, Barbara. These will be greatly cherished. And we will spread that universal love and energy all around the sanctuary. Because we are all about that here at Big Cat Rescue. We are great believers in the secret. It's one of our favorite books out here. You'll often hear us talking to each other about uh, using the secret, which is picturing what we want in life and picturing only the good so i think a lot of sanctuaries or uh, not sanctuaries but a lot of people in general think about all the horrible things that are happening to animals and they focus on that and i believe that whatever you think about you worry about so we try to stay focused on all of the good and how we want to see these animals living wild and free all of them being wild and free the way they should be and so staying focused on that helps us bring that good energy into the work that we do i'm losing track of which ones i've done not done here i've read this one and then up here behind me This is a coach purse. And I've never I've never spent the kind of money you have to spend to buy a coach purse before. And I want to read to you the person who gave me this gorgeous thing and it's got beautiful butterflies all over it. Of course, if you know me, you know my penchant for butterflies. They're all friends of mine. Piece of paper that told me who this was. So after much digging around in all of the paperwork that came in today, I think this came from Joyce. And thank you very much, Joyce. That was the only box down there that looked like it was big enough to have held this. And I thought when I put these cards in there that I had managed to keep with it the, the person who gave me this. So I think it's Joyce. If it's not, please let me know but it came with this cute card. Thank you. It says, Happy Mother's Day. Love all us cats and kitties and a Janet. <laughs> purr, purr, chuff, chuff, roar. And then the card that I thought would have <laughs> the name on it that does not says, Carol, all of the big cats and all of the cats, big and small, collected change they found around their homes to save up and get you something and to thank you for all you do. The Janet helped too. <laughs> they requested butterflies. Enjoy. Thank you. And then this lovely thing that you see back here is yesterday we had a whole bunch of the people who watch the Explore live webcams. Um, I don't know if they have a name for themselves other than like explore stalkers <laughs> and anyway six of them came out for a private tour and today they're here for the feeding tour and the keeper tour in fact I need to get back up there because their their uh, keeper tour is probably about to end um, but Lori uh, Lori Hobbs made this beautiful blanket with pictures from our cats and of course I don't know if you can guys know crackle up there but I think they said that was crackle and Now I'm forgetting who the tiger was. 
Um, I think that was Mrs. Claus and Little Feather and Nikita and then of course Cameron and Zebu. Not sure if that's Mrs. Claus or not. I think so. And then on the back it says the BCRX Explorers, the originals. And these guys have been with us from the very day that this camera first launched, which was a year ago in December. And it's signed by Lori, who is the one who actually created the blanket. And she goes by the name of Gideon. And Robin, who is Cracker Bob. And Jamie, who is a camera operator that they under that I understand they call Taco. And Lori, the secretary to the cats, who does all those letters to management that you guys love. And Hege. Hege, I'm not sure I'm pronouncing her name right, and she came with Suzanne, and they came all the way from Norway, from Norway, can you believe that, oh my god, I love it, and so a whole bunch of them went out this morning on the feeding tour, and on the keeper tour, and I need to run out there and make sure that I say hello to them before they leave for the day, so I'm going to leave it at this, but I love all you guys, thank you so much, if you've sent letters and stuff and I, I didn't include you, I'm very, very sorry. They have now filtered out into the sanctuary to make their ways to all of the other people that you mentioned in your letters. And I really appreciate all the love and support from you guys. Yeah. Oh, and they also gave me the cat ears. That was from the Explore group. They actually gave me three sets of cat ears, so I've got cat ears to last a while. Bye.